how to catch a Lovosaurus. This ought to be fun. On all the walls are posters and pictures too. Each shouts opening day. Come meet a rare find. The Natural History Museum has a new show. A special creature, warm, loving, and kind. Mm. In a great hidden valley, explorers discovered something enormous in size. A friend to the dinosaurs and each living thing had purple fur and big, bright blue eyes. Hmm. Interesting. He's called a Lovasaurus, the first ever found. His greeting had hugs and giggling sound. Then he spoke quite clearly and said to the team, to spread kindness and joy around the world is my dream. So happy you found me now, I can begin my quest. Can you bring me someplace to begin as your guest? Huh, so this one is not as hard to find or catch as the others, apparently. He was inside a theater behind the closed doors while a large crowd was waiting outside. We opened a side door to get a quick peek. He zoomed past us. And we saw his backside. His tail's got a heart on it. Interesting. Heart is a heart. People are waiting. We must get him back. But he's with the whale fish and shells. You'd think he'd be easy to spot in this room. All we can find is a note on the well. There's a ship. Okay. There's a note on this well. May all your wishes come true. It's a wishing well. Okay, let's see what happens next. There are knights in armor all around us now. We see feast and jousting and horses. There's a rustle, a clang, and a laughing sound. The guards want to know who the source is. Hmm, maybe he won't be so easy to catch. Not sure. Now they're in a planetarium. Earth, space, and planets. It's so dark in here. The amazing show lights up the sky. There's a note on each chair with a smiley face. Was that a tail we just saw fly by? Planetarium. Help us explore space. Oh, there he goes. In the African savanna with animals and more, there are so many places to hide. Behind tall giraffes or under the rhinos, how would he begin to decide? Hmm. Watering hole? Oh, there he is. Let's rest on the benches and sit for a while. There are crayons, paper, and pencils. These weren't here the last time we came. Now, how did he make animal stencils? Hmm. Well, arts and crafts time. He's rocking and rolling, apparently headed to Egypt, I guess. He's run over now to the Egypt exhibit. There are pharaohs and even a crypt. We see gold masks, jars, mummies, and signs. Then there's a loud bang when he slipped. Hmm. Mummy stuff, Egypt stuff, pharaoh stuff, and then he's off to see the dinosaurs. Of course it makes sense. This is where he would go. He loves his dinosaur friends. And here are more notes like, say hi, please, and thanks. Could this be where the chase ends? Help us catch a baby dinosaur. I know it's dinosaur, but I like saying it like that. He's vanished somehow. Nowhere to be seen. How could he be gone in a blink? He left us so many gifts, notes, and signs. There's a message he wants us to think. Oh, so maybe he wasn't hiding so much as he was leading them on a scavenger hunt of love. Let's see what these notes say. Be happy. Be yourself. Be sweet. Smile more. Listen. Be kind. You rock. You're great. Give hugs. Give a grin. Okay. 
Back at the theater, the doors are now open with flowers and notes on each chair. Each different, say hi, smile, share, you're great. And one big sign, spread kindness everywhere. So there's flowers on every chair and notes of love and kindness. And then one big chair here, spread kindness everywhere with some beautiful flowers. The love of source wants each of us to be happy. We didn't catch him, but his message is clear. We can share with everyone what's in his heart. Hugs, smiles, love, kindness, and cheer. Hmm. Being kind to your little brother, giving love notes to your mom and dad, or teachers or something, being loving toward others, helping people who need a hand, giving hugs, especially to old people like me. We head back through the museum and the exhibits we'd seen. Walking through each one takes a while. Everywhere we look, we see happy people. The love of Saurus made each person smile. Oh, he made each person smile. How lovely. And the book ends with spread kindness everywhere. What a wonderful message in a sweet little book. And they didn't catch this guy either. So these kids are very persistent, but also not great at catching mythical creatures. But I think this one, the point was to catch kindness and love, not necessarily to catch the love of source. I love you guys. Miss you. Can't wait to see you soon. Have a great day.